Hey everyone, it's Friday and Accelerate is here to give you the week's rundown that will ease you into this awesome weekend ahead. A lot of stuff happened this week, so we're going to break it down. My name is... What's my name again? It's Biadun and you're watching Accelerate News. Powerful African women winning everywhere. A big congratulations to Mo Abudu as she has been included in the list of 25 most powerful women in television globally by The Hollywood Reporter. She announced the news on her Instagram page. I mean, that lady is absolutely cool. In their citation for Mo Abudu, The Hollywood Reporter recognized her career transition and her growth and also acknowledged her network as a massive content producer. This feat is not just for her alone as the whole of Nigeria celebrates as we grow in the media sector. A huge congratulations Mo Abudu, keep on rocking. Eminem, oh. Eminem. Now, no one stirs up a storm better than this man right here. In the cypher at the BET Hip Hop Awards, the rapper had more than a few words to say about the president of the United States. This is said to be the fiercest hip hop attack against Trump and the video reached in over 5 million views in just 24 hours. <laughs> The rap is resonating with millions of people as it has been talked about by Snoop Dogg, Sean Diddy Combs, and T-Pain. They have all tweeted their support. However, not one tweet yet from Donald Trump. This is absolutely outstanding considering the fact that he spends more time on Twitter than concentrating in the Oval Office. Anyway, I'm sure we're going to hear from him soon. <laughs> DJ Spino has finally released his studio album titled Dreams. He shares that the album signifies a journey of growth and a dream dream of a certain future for him. The album, of course, features big names like Whiskid, David Doe, One Day Cole, Olamide, Simi, Mr. Easy, and many more. Listen to the album and let us know what your thoughts are. After shutting down breakup rumors from haters, DJ Copy comes back about a week later to admit that her and her footballer boyfriend Victor Anyechebe are no longer dating. She shared that distance, time difference, and tight shells were the reasons for the breakup. Now, anyway, the pair claimed that they're still friends. Oh well. Following the Fast and Furious 9 drama, The Rock has clapped back, throwing some major shade. Now, so you remember that Tyrese was sulking because The Rock Dwayne Johnson got his own spin-off from the Fast and Furious franchise? <laughs> well, Tyrese also blamed The Rock for the postponement of the release of the Fast and Furious 9 date. Well, Dwayne has finally replied. He showed his appreciation and excitement for the new movie and he ended with a saying from his character Hobbs, if you don't like it, we're happy to beat that ass like a Cherokee drum. Oof. This guy, this, this guy. <laughs> anyway, he ended with the hashtag, candy asses did not apply. The spin-off is due on the 29th of July, while the ninth main installment of the series is coming on the 10th of April 2020. In a new music video news, ahead of her third studio album, Yemi Alade drops the visuals for her song Nakupenda, featuring Kenyan singer Nyashiki. Now this is the Swahili version, and I don't know about you, but I think that she nailed it. You know how people were talking about Drake has gone off air and went to learn a new language? Well, Yemi Alade brought it home, guys. She literally just brought it home. Listen to it and watch the video, and let's know what your thoughts are. Johnny Drill! <laughs> Johnny Drill releases the visuals to his track since Johnny made it. Like, I'm fighting to hold back the tears because anytime Johnny Drill just opens his mouth, he's saying, he's just like, you just want to cry. He's, 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 he's Johnny Drill. <laughs> Anyway, since joining Maven, Johnny Drill releases the brand new video for his song titled Romeo and Juliet. It's such a beautiful love song. Watch it and share your thoughts in the comment section of our post below. That's it for today on Accelerate News. Don't forget to check out all the amazing content on our website and get your weekly dose of fashion with Fashion Fix and also our brand new show. We're never going to make it drop this week. There's so much for you to binge watch this weekend. My name is Bjorn and I'll see you guys on Monday. High five, everybody.